Dear citizens of Europe, the world is going through difficult times. People are sick, millions are unemployed. During such times, it's clear that your governments need to invest every available cent in your health, employment, and welfare. But did you know that instead of doing so, your government is using your hard-earned tax money to fund millions of euros to radical propaganda organizations in Israel every year? Yes, you heard correctly. Your government transfers millions of euros every year to radical NGOs in Israel, a small country the size of Slovenia that's surrounded by radical Islamic states seeking its destruction, but nonetheless remains free and democratic. And don't think that your taxes are going toward humanitarian or human rights organizations. They're going towards radical NGOs with ties to the Popular Front for the Liberation of Palestine, a terrorist organization even recognized as such by the European Union. In addition, your taxes are also being used to fund the legal defense of vile terrorists who murdered innocent civilians like the members of the Solomon family. Rather than caring for your needs, your governments fund radical Israeli NGOs that protect terrorists who murdered innocent Israelis like my husband, father-in-law and sister-in-law who were murdered by terrorists. How can you let this go on? If that wasn't enough, your money funds NGOs that promote the boycott of Israel. Even Germany, which passed a resolution in 2019 declaring that the BDS movement is anti-Semitic, still funds radical NGOs that promote BDS. Hypocrisy at its finest. And this is just the tip of the iceberg. European governments and the EU fund radical NGOs that work to eliminate the Jewish character of Israel, to change its immigration laws, and even work to change the IDF's rules of engagement and policies combating terrorism, which leads to further bloodshed. What would you do if a foreign government would fund millions of euros to radical European NGOs that petition your courts on behalf of terrorists who murdered innocent people or work to change your policies against terrorism. Would that be acceptable to you? Citizens of Europe, the time has come to tell your governments and the EU to stop funding extreme political propaganda NGOs in Israel. It doesn't help to resolve the conflict or bring peace. It doesn't help the Israelis or the Palestinians. In fact, it only widens the conflict and encourages more hatred, terrorism, and bloodshed. Sign the petition now and demand that your elected representatives put an end to these blood payments. 